Why is the DA pro-abortion? Lots of DA Christian votes are lost for this reason. I'm a Christian. And, you know, one of, my, one of the verses that I think gives Christianity much of what Christianity is about is that it says, I place before you life and death. Choose life. I think God, at least from my view, upholds the right for people to choose. I think this debate emanates from our Constitution, and our Constitution gives citizens the right to exercise their individual right to choose. We don't legislate for just Christians. We legislate for all South Africans, taking note of the context of where South Africans are at. And therefore, I'll always maintain citizens' right to choose. I would like to know if he would legalize cannabis for medical, recreational and industrial usage and if he would adopt the same drug policies that have been so successful in Portugal. Well, I think more than anything, um, already there's a constitutional court ruling on this issue. I think that citizens, I think there should be regulation as to how we, we administer that. I think certainly for medical purposes, I've seen how Cannabis is able to help people relieve pain. What we've got to figure out as a country is how do you manage the supply of that so that more it's regulated because sometimes in certain instances, cannabis is a, is a substrate. It's a fundamental drug for other things that people use. But I would urge more than anything that along with the constitutional decision making along with that, we need to make it clear that for more people, for more citizens, uh, we've got to create the regulation so that, the, so that there's responsible usage on this issue. Your thoughts on removing Afrikaans as a language in primary and high schools? Never. Afrikaans as a language is one of the official languages in this country. It is protected as a right. Citizens have an ability. As you will Afrikaans prat, then you must Afrikaans prat. As you will learn Afrikaans, then you must learn Afrikaans. Because if I start taking away the rights of an Afrikaans person to learn and communicate in Afrikaans, tomorrow I could take away the rights of a Zulu South African to learn and speak in Zulu, or an English South African, or a Tswana South African. One South Africa for all does not mean we all blend in and become the same. One South Africa for all says you have the right to learn and speak and uphold your identity as I have the same right. So I'm not Afrikaans speaking. And I don't, um, and I will ultimately ensure that the rights of Afrikaners to speak Afrikaans be protected. Because it's the gift, it's, it's, it's an understanding that I don't need to be Afrikaans to protect Afrikaners. It's the understanding that says their rights are as important as someone else's rights.